So, I don't know if you can tell, but I did a pretty big mod to the 240. If you can tell by the uh, hood and the rear view mirror. I uh, went ahead and did a Infiniti G35 swap. So I no longer have a 240. It's sold. It's gone. So now I have to find a new way to love this car. And I went out and bought a 06 Infiniti G35 Coupe Sports Edition. Uh, it's got the navigation. Uh, the Bose audio system, black leather seats, six-speeded, and uh, it's pretty nice. It is pretty nice. I like it so far. It also has the rev-up engine, so I do miss the 240, and I loved it, and I learned a lot from it, but now it was just time to move on, and here we are. So here it is. Uh, the guy I bought it from was a smoker and I've done my best to try and get the smoke out the smell of the smoke as much as I can out of here so my next thing I'm, I'm doing to it is a cabin filter so I'm sure that needs to be replaced uh, I'll get outside of it so I can show you all the exterior but interior is pretty clean I mean I cleaned it up a lot but it's pretty much untouched uh, other than a few small things but uh, I went ahead and bought a Nismo sticker for it. That's pretty, it's like tradition almost for me. That's like my first thing I do to every one of my cars is put a Nismo sticker on it. So, so yeah, it's pretty fun. It's, it's hard to say that it's not fast because it feels slow. I mean, by no means is it fast, but it feels slower than the 240 just because it's not, it's not that, uh, it's a, it's an NA motor. It doesn't have that punch like the turbos do, with, like the SR did. And it's a bit heavier, so... I mean, it is what it is, but, you know, this is what I got now, and this is what I'm working with, so... So the car is very dirty at the moment, but it has the 19-inch raised wheels. Um, all black. You got the side skirts. Um clear corners, the sport bumper, so yeah, it's pretty clean, I mean, exterior wise, it needs a good wax, but other than that, in a clay bar. Yeah, so this is the new project, the 240's gone, had a lot of good memories with it, Went through a lot of emotional, mental, and physical physical abuse with that car. Because, God, every time I got it running, it was only a matter of time. But anyways, it was a fun car, and it, it, was, it was pretty reliable. Whatever, I never messed with it. I mean, it ran fine. It was just that when I got it itched to do something, I don't know, it just didn't work out. But I'll get another 240 later on. But for now, this will just have to hold me over. Uh, I guess the first thing I really want to do to it is the suspension. Right now it's on teen lowering springs and if you can, I don't know if you can tell or not, but the front sits way lower than the rear, which kind of sucks because, I, don't, I mean, I know how to drive a lower car, but with my 240 I had it raised up enough that, you know, I could go over decent sized bumps and curbs with no problem. This I like scrape on everything and it's like, oh my god, was that, is the bumper still going to be there? But so coilovers will probably be in the moderate to near future and uh, that's all I got for y'all hope you enjoyed this video uh, comment tell me what you think about the car if you got any advice let me know and uh, I'll see y'all later